Said she tired, little money, need a big boy Pull up 20 inch blades like a real toy Now it's everybody flocking, need a decoy Shorty mixing up the vodka with the decoy Boom, all right, we're back with another gym review. We're here in Brisbane uh, in a suburb called Stafford. We're coming to a gym today, which is World's Stafford Gym. It's fairly new, it's about one year old. Uh, so it's, it's pretty exciting. It's very big inside. I've just had a look, a sneak peek, and I'm excited to, to get in there and show you what they've got to offer. Uh, so let's go, eh? Head in. I'm trying to get started with it. Eh? I'm trying to get started with it. So we're gonna, do, we're gonna do some arms today. This is another special video. I have two of my best mates joining me in an, in an upper workout. They got Chris, Chris Black here and Clint Porcel over there. <laughs> uh, yeah. Just gonna get into some warm ups as we do, five to ten minutes. Got a cardi on me popping when I shoot, I never miss. She gon' ask if I'm in love, I never lie, I plead the fifth. Only want me cause I'm icy and I'm pricey with the fist. You can see the way I'm shiesty, all my diamonds really gliss. Got a cardi on me popping when I shoot, I never miss. She gon' ask if I'm in love, I never lie, I plead the fifth. Only want me cause I'm icy and I'm pricey with the fist. You can see the way I'm shiesty. Casual visit was $25. Which is pretty standard down here in Brisbane. This is big. When you click on our videos, make sure you like, subscribe, and support our, support our channel. You know, we're doing this stuff for you guys. Whenever you're traveling and looking at a place to train, check the channel, pretty useful, no? First-hand experience of gyms on the east coast of Australia. And hopefully once we've covered the east coast, we'll go to the west coast, south Australia, and even far as Darwin, so pretty excited, eh, Gazelle? Gonna get it done, whole of Australia, and then we'll go worldwide. Gonna warm up a bit more. I like my arms being nice and warm before we start lifting some heavy weights to avoid any injury around my elbows. I didn't mention before though, Chris, not only my best mate, but he's also my, my, my coach. I'm currently prepping for a show in October and it's pretty cool to see, see Chris one-on-one, -on -one, face to face so he can assess my body um, because sometimes checking photos don't do, don't do justice. So yeah, later on hopefully we'll get some posing done. So how many, how many reps and sets? So on this we're going to go 10 to 12. Set nice and comfortable. Two, we'll go two, two to start with and then and see how we feel. See the way I'm shiesty on my diamonds really glitz. Got me charged up like a Tesla with the whole world in my hand. Mama told me keep it moving so I don't fear any man. You ain't really with the shits and you don't even got a plan. Most these rappers really capping when they say they get in bands. Plus I know the shit you saying when I'm really not around. All that talking gets you lit, you steady playing not a bound. Now you trying to be a friend to me too late, you really foul. Ain't no way one's in this game cause after one you fouling now, yeah. Cool. Gotta go turbo mode, you know? <laughs> Hyper speed. Wells Gym being a, a chain of gyms. This one's quite, quite huge, commercial gym. As you can see, they got a lot of everything. A lot of everything. And a lot of cardio equipment, a lot of machines, a lot of dumbbells. Um, it's pretty cool. And they have a functional training area, area over here on the left. It's quite big as well. They have some upstairs facilities. Right now they're doing some posing for upcoming competitions. Yeah, so on this one, I think we're gonna carry, carry the uh, 10 to 12 rep range throughout, yeah? Yeah, so we've got a just moderate session today. So usually we undulate through different rep ranges each week. So at the moment, today we're doing obviously a bicep tricep session. So. We'll be undulating through that 10 to 12 kind of rep range. Um, so probably for this movement, we'll just do two working sets uh, and we'll probably take it yeah. pretty, pretty close to failure, probably around RP8 or nine. So one or two reps in the tank. Bigger compound stuff at the beginning of session and then later in the session, we'll um, move to some more pumpy sort of work. This we is started over group? on the breacher curl. Um, nice isolation, a lot of stability in the exercise. Then we'll go to more of a 
This is still stability, but a free weight sort of compound with a bit of a press, and then we'll move over to a heavy bicep movement. Got a cardi on me popping when I shoot, I never miss. She gon' ask if I'm in love, I never lie, plead the fifth. Only want me cause I'm icy and I'm pricey with the fist. You can see the way I'm shiesty, all my diamonds really gliss. Got a cardi on me popping when I shoot, I never miss. She gon' ask if I'm in love, I never lie, plead the fifth. Only want me cause I'm icy and I'm pricey with the fist. You can see the way I'm shiesty, all my diamonds really gliss. Mr. Flex a lot, I told you that I do this on the regular. My cellular be jumping cause these people never get enough. The best I'm up, never be regretting. And what I says to them, I'm unapologetic. Uh, so we got an incline, dumbbell curl. I had a refeed yesterday consuming around 400 grams of carbs. So, quite vascular today. Yeah, big time. Feeling good. So just come off the back of seven straight low days, just to really get him in ahead of conditioning. So we really want to drive him in early so we can refill and play with some peaking strategies towards the back end of prep. Um, to his men's physique show, so it's going to be good. Looking forward to it. Let's get some dumbbells. Yeah, this one. Ooh, quite full. So, this movement here, incline dumbbell curl, really focusing on targeting the bicep in its mid and lengthened position. Um, we started off over on the preacher curl, which was more shortened position. When we're training muscles, we want to be training them through their full active range of motion. Um, and where they're obviously strongest and weakest. So this movement here is a fantastic movement for overall bicep development. Little tip, making sure you're keeping the pinkies yeah. up at the top. One more. Oh my God, that was it. Oh, that's a good one. That was the one. Yeah. That was beautiful. So these people think I'm testing them. Leveling up on the daily and nothing can face me, I'm king of the game. Hey, but the comments the Louis the Prada, then it's not my problem, I'm sorry to say. All my life I'm really popping off, I'm sorry for the way. Y'all disgusting and be falling off, you really never change. Got a cardi on me popping when I shoot, I never miss. She gon' ask if I'm in love, I never lie, I plead the fifth. Only want me cause I'm icy and I'm pricey with the fist. You can see the way I'm shiesty, all my diamonds really gliss. Got a cardi on me popping when I shoot, I never miss. She gon' ask if I'm in love, I never lie, I plead the fifth. Only want me because I'm icy and I'm pricey with the fist. You can see the way I'm shiesty, all my diamonds really gliss. It's warm now. A big mistake a lot of people make on this movement, use too much weight and just end up messing up their elbows, getting a ton of elbow issues and, and pain. You don't need a ton of weight. Focus on keeping the elbows in as opposed to flaring them out at the bottom and control the weight on the way down. Nothing explosive. Even you start when you start doing these, chuck some pauses in at the bottom just to make sure that um, you're controlling that movement from start to finish. One. Come on, push, push, push. Let's go. It's tightening up. Oh. There you go, nice. Beautiful. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Perish, this shit high, boy. Try to catch a vibe, yeah, I had to put her on. Bought a two skitter, yeah, we heading for the sun. Try to get my heart, I ain't tripping for the fun. Yeah, I won't start, I ain't tripping, I'm a stun. Oh, oh, living lively. Everybody trying to ride my wave, they can ride me. Pull up in a foreign to the curb, looking icy. I ain't never stressed about a fit, I'm on hype. Yeah, 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 yeah. One poke. Uh, 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 on. Third place. Uh, hey, come third place. You're supposed to get second. First. <laughs> oh my god. To warm up, eh? Yeah. Don't tear the bicep, D. Oh, dude. So we have a cable, cable bicep curl. Coming to the end of the work here. Everyone's got a pump, and like I said back, Lenny P, he's turned into a real life Arnold Schwarzenegger. Nice. Less skinny than, just a little bit less skinny than before. <laughs> <laughs> you got a close grip on this? Mm -hmm. No, oh yeah, actually I did, did. I did. Out of here? No, no, I won. Yeah, that's it, yeah. I like it out of here. Oh. 
It's always good catching up with the boys, especially over workout. <laughs> uh, before we just had something to eat for brekkie. Talked about life, where we're at in life. It's always good, isn't it? It's oh, good, good check-in. Beautiful time. Uh, a well-being check-in, life check-in. Make sure we're always growing, physically, emotionally, spiritually, career-wise. Yeah. Love life, I've relationships. Been since we were like kids. Really too young. long. Way too long. Too long. <laughs> like nearly 30 now. 27. Holy God. Oh, we're pretty much 30. Just accept it. <laughs> the first time I met you, we're about five years, six years old. Yeah, it's been a while. Those are the days. And I remember racing the old 200, 100 meter sp sprints against Kenny P in grade like four and five into, into school sports day. I won't talk about it. <laughs> All right, let's finish this off, eh? Let's get Do it. it. Energy's yeah, slumping yeah. very fast. <laughs> Been a bag and need my markets to the clerk, hello Walk in with my bitch, you walk all yellow Catch on flights, gotta stop in a lot of heat throw Sitting by the window while I'm counting Cenos Spend another bag and we do it all again We tryna run it up to my ball, what's the plan? All up in my mentions when I see them, they my fans You win, then you lose, gotta take another chance Let's go to my lady, yeah, call me when you need me If I told them what I made, they would not believe me, yeah who said this shit was easy? Got some love in the bay, I feel like g -Eazy. Bitch, I'm fired up, I feel like KBZ Your times are solo shows in the all lined up I cannot complain cause this is what I signed up for Alright We just pumped a good arm session With Chris and Clint and yourself Gazelle, so It was pretty good in there What do you reckon about the, the overall The overall environment? So I think just the overall theme in there is it's like it's serious, but it's also open to, there's some beginners in there as well. I think yeah. everyone in there felt comfortable. Everyone in there was just kind of minding their own business. Everyone seemed really friendly. Yeah, so overall, very friendly. I think it's, um, yeah, there's really nice equipment. All the kit was really good. Nothing was really out of order, I don't think, except for maybe one piece or so. So I'm not sure how long they take to get the pieces, you know, re uh, repaired and stuff, but overall, everything was pretty good experience. Yeah. It also gave us some free uh, drinks upstairs, so. That was good. good. Little bonus. Little bonus. So yeah, like if you're in the area, it's a really good, good gym to to come and experience. You know, it's big. It's got everything you need. They had saunas in the the bathrooms, upstairs posing area, a Pilates space there. Um, yeah, overall, I reckon it was really good as well. So, just an update on my physique as well. What are you? What are your thoughts? Yeah. So obviously now. Coming into nine weeks out, um, as of as of probably to yesterday or yesterday, so nine weeks out from the first show of the season, which would be the IFBB, uh, uh, IFBB Queensland qualifier, um, before we then come into nationals, which would be three weeks later. So physique's coming along really nicely. We've pulled uh, pretty hard over these last couple of weeks. So I'm really looking to get Azra ahead. Um, I think he's weighing in it, like you wouldn't believe it with how much muscle he's carrying, but he weighs about 85, 86 kilos. Um, I still think we've probably got at least another three to five kilos to pull off to be absolutely peeled. Um, so over this next, you know, four weeks or so, we're really going to be looking to pull in hard and, and go pretty aggressive with the diet. Um, but physique's really starting to shape up now. All, everything's there. He's not like not lacking any muscle groups. The overall taper, so he'll be competing in men's physique. Um, so really, what we're looking for there is uh, basically the all the beach body. So he'll be wearing board shorts on stage. So really nice big arms, nice full shoulders, nice full pecs. Um, and then just a lot of posing and flair comes, comes into that as well. And that's what we're working on today upstairs when we're going through the stuff outside is just um, trying to make sure that his posing is on point because it's a really overlooked thing is it's like even in men's physique, although you're only hitting really like three different shots from like the front, maybe two from the front, the side-ish and the rear, um, you need to be making sure you're posing with flair and those, lo those little tiny bits really make, do make a difference. So. Uh, it's good for me to see Azra again in person so I can obviously catch up with him and make sure that his posing is on point and tweak little things that don't, don't necessarily come across in uh, you know videos and stuff that he, he will send me to because he's obviously based up in Cairns and I'm based on the Sunshine Coast now. So, but yeah, really happy with the overall package. Seats coming together really nicely. Just a little bit left to go. Sweet. So, yeah, that's a wrap. Mm, stuffed, to be honest. Um, 
Like, as I said at the start of the video, Chris has been my coach for around, since yeah, the beginning, man. since the beginning, since we started lifting weights as young pups. So it's always been a, a good a sounding board to, to go off and, and talk to throughout the years that we've been lifting weights. So if you're interested in training and nutrition and you, and you need some advice and some help to guide you on your way in your fitness journey, look up Chris on Instagram, uh, DM him and um, he'll, be get, he'll be getting back to you for sure. So I'm always yeah. happy to help. If you've liked the video, make sure you, you get on there, give us a thumbs up and subscribe. I really appreciate the support on the channel. And again, it's just for you guys. So have a good day. <laughs> Let's go home.